I, I fully agree that you need to account for different types of migrants. I mean, you cannot uh, say that the effects of migration is the same independent of the source of the... We, for example, find in economic studies that it often matters whether the people who are migrating are skilled or unskilled. I think it's very important in relation to migrant and refugees uh, that move because of war and forced uh, migration issues, that there's a whole range of different issues associated with this because every receiving country has a responsibility to help refugees. We have a, a shared responsibility to receive refugees and help them because they are in desperate conditions. So, so the kinds of questions that, 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 that come up in, those, in that kind of situation are a little bit different. But even in relation to people who have fled from war and other circumstances, you can point to positive impacts because they may contribute uh, a specific addition to the labor force that can, if you assume, if you pursue uh, proper integration policies, they may add to the uh, uh, labor force. They may add new information, they may add new knowledge that the existing, the receiving country, does not have. And once you start adding all these things together, then it can, in the longer run, become an asset, become a value of the, uh, the country that receives, uh, in, for example, in this case, refugees. It's not going to happen overnight. Because, of course, there are costs associated with receiving people at short notice. They have to be fed. They have to have uh, supplies. They have to start eventually getting into schools. All of that is associated with costs. But don't necessarily think only of the short-run costs. Sometimes short-run costs can be investment that can actually pay back in just a little bit longer time perspective. Make sure that all efforts are made to integrate as much as absolutely possible, uh, taking account of differences of circumstances from each case to the next. But the more you integrate, the more you have, try to have a constructive approach to the issue, the better the final outcome is for everybody, for the one that has fled from impossible circumstances or moved because the person is in search for better economic opportunities on the one hand and also for the country that then receives the uh, refugee or the migrant.